welcome student to the lecture number 8 and uh, this lecture is on the topic verb and it is included in your unit number 3 and we are discussing the kinds of a verb some of it we discuss in lecture number 7 so here in this lecture we will be discussing transitive verb and intransitive verb a transitive verb is a verb which takes an object to complete the message and to complete the meaning here i have given you example he broke the pot in this sentence this part the pot is uh, an object suppose if you remove this and you put a full stop here he broke full stop now the reader would ask the audience would ask that what what did he break so without this object the meaning is incomplete that is why it is called a transitive verb because it needs an object to complete the meaning similarly look at another this example aisha writes a novel writes is a verb now if you want to check it that whether it is transitive or intransitive you have to put an object or remove an object suppose if you remove this a novel which is an object in this sentence and you put a full stop here this would become aisha writes so what what does she write a novel a short story a book a letter or what so without this object the meaning is incomplete so transitive verbs are those verbs which needs objects to complete their meaning and transitive verb is on the other hand against or opposite to the transitive verb a verb which does not take an object how suppose when you say she runs okay yes the meaning is complete she runs similarly they sleep again the meaning is complete you do not need an object here to complete the meaning so this is the difference between transitive verb and intransitive verb transitive verb requires an object and intransitive verb does not require an object okay that is clear i hope so then this transitive verb is further divided into two mono transitive and di transitive mono mean one and di mean two so mono transitive is that transitive which needs one object a single object how when you say he broke the pot the meaning is complete but di transitive verb would need two object like look at this sentence they mad him they mad him what so the president if you do not put this object the president here the meaning will not be completed so this sentence this verb made would need two object one is him and the other one is the president then it would complete the meaning so i hope that this is pretty much clear if you are having any confusion you can text me in my personal whatsapp thank you very much